Hey guys, I'm Tori Sterling and welcome back to my channel. So today we're doing a video all about winged eyeliner for hooded eyes. I have had hooded eyes my whole life, so I never really think about doing my makeup in terms of like in needs for hooded eyes. But I have been getting a lot of comments asking me about it lately, so I decided to show you guys. I've done a few winged liner tutorials before, and of course all my tutorials that have winged eyeliner in it, I sort of show you it, but I never really went in detail of how I shape my eyeliner to work with my hooded eyes. If you guys are new to my channel, be sure to hit that subscribe button right down there. Join the fan bam, I upload content all the time. Ask anyone in the family, they all know. We're all a big, loving, happy family, so join it, subscribe, and you'll see content from me all the time. All right, so without any further ado, let's get on to the video. So for this look, I'm going to be using two different eyeliners. So the first one that I'm going to be using is the Tarte Tartiste Gel Liner, and then I use the NYX Vinyl Liquid Liner. I first go in with gel to map out my look, and then I use the liquid to sharpen it and define it. I don't always use both, but on most days I prefer to. And the brush that I use with the gel liner is the brush that comes with it. I find that it's actually really, really good and it's my favorite. So the best advice that I can give anyone with hooded lids for winged liner is to make the line as straight as you possibly can across. I know mine has a little bit of like a slope and an up angle, but with my eye shape, this looks best. But if you focus on keeping it as straight across as you possibly can, it's going to look best. And that's because if you were to like slope it up, when you go to connect it back down onto your lid, it's gonna, like when you open your eye, it's gonna look wonky and it's gonna look like you have this like line that's going all over the place. It's gonna look very wiggly, even though it could be perfectly straight. When you open your eye, you're gonna lose the liner and you're gonna lose the wing and it's just gonna look like a little line of a tail. And that's not what you want your winged liner to look like. So keep it straight. You can totally slant your wing, but when you connect it back to your eye, keep it straight. So what I first do is map out where I want my liner to sort of go. So I don't focus on the wing at first, I just sort of fill in my upper lash line. So when I open my eye, you guys can tell that the liner kind of disappears. So I also recommend to keep this kind of on the thinner side. I like to have mine like a good thickness where you can see it, but also not too thick. And now I start mapping out the shape of my wing, and this is going to be different for every eye shape. A good guideline is to take a makeup brush and to line it up from your nose to your eyebrow. So I just start with small strokes, flicking my brush outwards. Then I connect my line back onto my lash line using small strokes. And if you guys can see here, I kind of overline it a little bit and this is just so that I can create a straight line back onto my lash line. And then I slowly go in and fill it in with the remaining liner that's on my brush. So once I have the basic shape of the wing down, it looks a little blunt in my opinion. Um, I always like to go in and just kind of elongate it a little bit, make it a little more wispy. So that's when I go in with the liquid liner. Then with the liquid liner, I go back in and critique everything and elongate my wing by flicking it outwards. Um, this is going to smooth out my black lines and kind of, I don't know, just make them a little bit more blended together. And then after my line has been created, I just like to go back in one more time with my gel liner and make sure that my line from my wing to my lash line is straight and it's not slopey or slanty. So if you guys can tell there, it's like a straight line from here all the way in. I'm going to finish up this eye and I'll be right back. 
Thank you guys so much for watching this video. I really hope you guys all did enjoy it. If you guys want to check out more videos, you are in luck. My last video is right here. And then I also have a little special video just for you right here. So be sure to check that out as well. I love you guys all so much. Have a great day. Bye.